All right, Moses, join me on the dance. First look at sports, and of course, been nothing but laughs and good times for the Baker Hughes Bobcats. And of course, you can when you're off to such a strong start for the new year. You know, a perfect six and zero definitely helps quell all of those issues, especially in the month of January, propelling the team to top spot in that North Division. Matt Schumont has more on the team's recent stretch. Coming up short at the Max Tournament over the Christmas break, head coach Cole Fisher said that tournament couldn't have come at a better time as it brought his team closer. And it's shown winners of their last eight games, including a perfect month of January, winning all six games by a combined score of 24 to 10. The light kind of went off on some guys as far as how they need to play and the systems we need to play to be successful. And, and I think it showed uh, our goals against has gone way down. And, and uh, we've been able to play a full 60 minutes and be very consistent throughout the games. And with the recent winning, the Bobcats have shot up the standings and sit atop the North Division standings. And when asked about the recent play, it was nothing but positivity. The contributions we've got from everybody, uh, you know, uh, from the goaltenders out to the to the forwards, everybody's, you know, one night it's one line that's doing most of the scoring, and the next it's the other, and we've. We've had some guys really step up defensively. And guys are always playing for each other. Guys are starting to play for each other now, and uh, like they always have, but more than ever right now, and uh, I think that's the key part to our winning. Now with over a week off between games, these last few days of practice have been a chance for the team to have some fun and let loose. We wanted to have some fun on uh, yesterday, and uh, you know we did, and uh, every practice it seems like we're always starting to have a lot of fun now, and everyone's coming to work, so it's been good so far. Matt Schumont, New Cap Sports. Thanks a lot, Matt. We'll move on to Bantam Hockey. The Lloydminster Universal Heat in action last night, hosting Fort Saskatchewan. To the first period, Heat tried to take advantage of a Rangers double minor. Ty Smith, no look pass to Kobe Moore, off the post. Same power play, pass attempt. Gets redirected in front of goal. Logan Ganey hits the other post. Heat would finally take advantage on the PP. Smith sets up Zane Franklin for the blast. 1-0 home side. Now Fort Sask would get an opportunity. Jackson Batak. Can't get enough wood on it in the slot. Easy save for Austin Pryor. Late in the period, Bryce Kindop down the wing. Teaches us a valuable lesson to just throw it on net. Good things will happen. 2-0 heat through 20 minutes. So just 42 seconds into the second. Turnover at the blue line. Jansen Leslie skates in and lets one rip. The captain makes it three zip. The heat coming for more. Smith with the pass out to Ganey. Ganey. We'll move into the slot to Chase Stevenson, who leaves it on a silver platter for Kindop for his second. That makes it 4 0. Kindop, he wouldn't be finished yet. Midway point at the game. Kindop, another chance here. He completes the hat trick. He had three goals and two assists to cap off the night. He cruised to a 9 0 thumping of the Rangers.